Oh no, I don't like that. Ah, uh, run! If you're enjoying Battlevoid Harbinger, be sure to click that thumbs up and leave a comment for me and subscribe for more content. Hello and welcome back to another episode of Battlevoid Harbinger. My name is Dreaded Entity. Um, when we left off, I think we were... Well, let's see. Okay, we're still in this map, so... I think the best course of action... Oh, okay, I wanted to clear out the map and then move on. I wonder what's down here in this unexplored sector. By the way, guys, I've noticed in my analytics that the vast majority of my viewers are not subscribed, so if you guys like the game, please just subscribe. Click that little red button. I'm gonna have videos up on it. I've got a whole playlist. I do other games too. All right, that's enough. Uh, that's enough of that. Let's get back to the game. <laughs> that was embarrassing. So I'm in this asteroid sector here. And let's see, I'm just waiting for my energy to fill up and we're gonna get out of here. I wanna attack this station right here to the side. Okay, cool. So, oh look, I found another friendly station. Weird. Um, yeah, I don't really need scrap or, or really upgrade points too, too badly right now. So let's, I'll just sweep around here and then we'll leave. All right, oh. Okay, I thought I spawned far away from this station, but I'm like right on top of it. All right, so very first thing I'm gonna do is get all my all my ships to get away from here. And let's see, I think that's far enough. So let's have these guys stack up. Okay, you stack them up just in case there's something nasty in this crate. Doesn't look like it. Cool. So got that. I'm just gonna go ahead and sell that. It's a piece of junk. Um, let me stack those up. All right. Now we'll go ahead. Oh, let's try to help this guy out. He looks like he might go down. Oh man, he really might go down. I don't want that. I will save you. I promise, I'll save you. Come on. Oh no, he jumped out and blew up my friendly ship. You gotta be kidding me. I'm sorry. We couldn't save him. But he is jumping over here to this station, and we are going to absolutely make him pay for that. We're gonna get we're gonna get him back for our friendly that didn't make it. He couldn't help us on our journey. We're getting revenge for you. There we go. These guys don't stand a chance. They're especially gonna pay for what they did. Done. And I can pick up a mission from here. Let's uh, get the station to repair itself. And, huh, this is actually pretty... This is really nice. Lots of... Lots of payment, and I only have to travel one sector away. Cool. Let's do it. Let's wipe them out. Okay, we jumped right on top of that ship, but it turned out not to be too big of an issue. And he fled. Okay, his particle turrets are amazing. Um, guys, I think we were pretty lucky. Um, the the wanderers right now, since they're so missile heavy, now that we got full point defense, we got tons of bombers out. We were pretty lucky not to face them in the very beginning, because um, if you get them as your first sector, it's it, it's going to be really tough, if, if at all possible to actually win or even just get past the first map um, so I think in that in that regard we got kind of lucky that we faced off against the Celestials 
firsthand. And then we're, we're just now facing the Wanderers later on. Um, okay, so we can jump probably a few spaces before we see any enemies, I'm hoping. Kind of want to clear this map. No, oh, okay. Uh-huh, nice. We got a large number of jumps there. Wow. Okay, that was kind of surprising. <laughs> and then look, right here there's an enemy. Okay, let's take this guy out. He's gonna have absolutely no chance. What? He jumped out? That's crazy. Where's he gonna go? Alright, I'll take on four capital ships. Yeah, I can do that. Okay. Yeah, I think I'll just let... I'll just let them handle it. No problem, guys. See, they thought they had the advantage, that's why they didn't try to jump. And, uh, yeah, that was a mistake. Because I, I wouldn't jump into a sector if I didn't think that I could win. Okay, let's hope we don't get hit by too many asteroids. Let's jump out of here. It's always kind of annoying, to be honest, when you have to go through an asteroid sector or one of these storm sectors before you can leave the map. But not too big of a deal. We got some of the biggest, baddest ships you can get. Got a container. I'm going to pop this container too, why not? It was a trap. Okay, nothing that'll trouble us too much. Did he really jump? He did. Not a problem. Okay, I think... All my bombers are rebuilt, and uh, let's go ahead and finish this map off. Let's see. Um, oh man, this is going to be kind of tough. We've got four capital ships and a station. I think we can do it, though. Oh, this guy jumped in behind us. Oh man. Guys, I can only imagine what that would look like in real life. If, like, you're all just chilling near your station, hanging out, having fun, and all of a sudden, just like, fleet shows up with a million bombers, starts blowing everything up. I guess I'd imagine that'd be quite scary. Let's see. I could always replace some of these lasers. The problem is none of these other point defense are really very good. They always like, with the laser it shoots directly on the target, it never misses, but like these bolters they kind of like just shoot everywhere. That's the same thing with the Gatlin, the Gatlings. Um, I guess I'll just sell them. I could always make other stuff stronger, like I could even probably fill out the hull damage on some of my bombers. The hull damage is really, I think, the one you want to get. There's something else. Another Gatling. Okay. Anything else? No. Okay. Finish that map. Let's get out of here. Now we're on map three of four. Okay. Maybe there's not five. I thought there was five. But I guess I'm wrong about that. Let's continue. And we're going to fight the Trollgar this time. I really don't remember what kind of weapons they use. Okay, the, yeah, these are the guys you have to fight, the asteroid stations. Oh wait, what was my reward? Ah oh, man, I didn't see. Alright, I guess we'll find out after. 
after we win. So first things first, let's jump in here. Just two capital ships are not going to be an issue for us in any way whatsoever. Oh! Oh! Okay. So those are the flat cannons, or maybe they're turrets with the... Uh, they're gun turrets with the maximum split upgrades. Not too sure, but that really put some hurt on our... Uh, That really put some hurt on our uh, bombers. I kind of want to pop a distress beacon here. I could probably pull these two, but then I would have three. But how many of these would I have to fight? I'm not sure. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do here? I'm gonna stack up, and then I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm gonna pop the distress beacon, and we're gonna go for it. And. uh... And if we die, sorry. <laughs> really? Just two? Alright. That's fine, too. I can definitely fight two. They try. They try, but they just can't. What's this? Two projectile cannons. Okay, so these are the, like, the gun cannons, like what I have here. Their accuracy is... Wait, the accuracy is actually better than my accuracy. Alright, I'll replace mine. These are terrible. Alright. So... So guys, despite hating the uh, the aliens, we now don't have any human weapons on our main ship. I wonder if I should get more... Oh, it actually does less damage because it shoots too. In addition to the accuracy being way down. I could always boost accuracy though. Then it shoots slower. Hmm. Something to think about. For now, I'm going to pop another Distress Beacon. Got two more. Not an issue at all. Oh, man. It's really just not fair, guys. It's not fair for them at all. Sell that. Got lots of upgrade points for that. You know what? I think I am going to... Um... Let's put one hull on all of them. Let me look at this one. Okay. Yeah, eventually that becomes astronomically expensive, but for now I can, I can handle it just fine. Mm, look, we got three capital ships going in over there. Uh, no other capital ships in my vicinity. Kind of worried, but I think we can handle them. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Uh-oh. No. Oh, no. I don't like that. Ah! Run! <laughs> okay. Okay. Alright. Now we're back. Back on top. Goodbye, Nemesis, with the particle turret. Coming in again to save the day. Go ahead and recycle that. Um, yeah, so the recycle thing, I wasn't really aware of this before, but uh, I saw that in a comment, so thank you so much for telling me about that. That is awesome. So I don't even have to sell stuff at a station now. I can just recycle it right there. I mean, like, I was aware of it, obviously, but I didn't know that it actually gave you the same amount of materials for selling it to a station. Let's jump in here. Let's jump in blind. Let's do it. I got no problems. I got no issues right now. And we're going to pop the trap, too. Because I am unafraid right now. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, Celestial Energy Cannon? Oh, cool. Interesting. This thing has considerably more accuracy than my... than my Ion Cannon. You always gotta wonder, though, like, is this actually making me stronger? The hull damage is a lot worse. I don't think this is gonna make me stronger. Because, honestly, with the bombers, like... I mean, there's gotta be, like, 50 bombers there. The, uh... I, I really doubt that... My, uh... My broadside cannons actually hit anything. Um, other than the particle turret. They just move too slowly, really. We come in here, it's literally just fighters. That is not an issue to us in any way. Um, oh no, can we save this guy? Three capital ships already fighting him. He got, he's got two more inbound. Let me pop a distress beacon. See if we can pull him. Okay, cool. <laughs> we got four. And now there's just one in there. We're gonna save this guy easy. No problem. Ooh, big mistake on you for jumping in right on top of me. See, that's, uh... That's why you gotta pay attention to where you're jumping in. Guess the aliens don't know that. But, uh... But you should. Could save your life. Would well, It will save your life. Not just could. Another nemesis? Okay. Well, you didn't make it. You didn't make it either. No. I'm definitely not gonna leave and bring you something and then come back just for <laughs> having you for four turns. Although that would be pretty interesting. I wonder how big the f the biggest fleet I can get would be. That's an interesting thought. Just how overwhelming can I make my fleet? One guy, he just, he instantly was like, oh no, we're outmatched, I'm out of here. Little did he know, I will come for you. You're not getting away. I hate these. Okay, these are the ones that damage your hull just for being there. Ah, why is he... Okay, you can leave, but you will find no quarter. There is nowhere safe for you to go. So look, just for being here, my bombers are all starting to blow up, and that feels bad, man. So hopefully there's not too bad of a fight right on the other side of this. Oh, nice. I don't, I don't even want to go in that asteroid sector, so let's not do that. Three capital ships, that is kind of a fight. Um, and all my bombers are blown up, but I am going to jump as quickly as possible. Because um, I'm losing my bombers, I'm losing my hull, just for being in there. So, oh, two, three, I got three bombers to fight three capital ships with. I can do it. Not an issue. Let's pop this crate, too. Oh, see, these are the these are the Gatlins. Pretty bad, right? They didn't even get that missile. Terrible. You want the laser cannons, guys. Oh, I got a blueprint for the Malragorg. Gatlins are, ugh, just terrible. I don't want that at all. Hey, we got a station here. Two stations. Six ships. I want that. I want to fight six ships. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, no. Guys, I think I might have just gotten more than I bargained for. 
Um, all right, let's stack up. No problem. Okay, they're in position, and let's wait. Oh man, this is scary. All right, yeah, that wasn't too bad actually. Just gonna sell these things. I don't even want to pick these up. These are not good weapons. Um, let's do it again. See if we can pull any more. Only got two this time. Pop another one. No, didn't do anything. Instantly gets annihilated. Alright. Got three this time coming. Cool. They don't have any chance, guys. And I think... Um... I don't think they have any factories, so if I just kept popping distress beacons, I think eventually we would kill all the capital ships. But, uh, let's go see what we can do for this guy. Oh, this is pretty nice, just for picking up a couple items. Okay. Good reward, and all I had to do was pick up some crap, so... Uh, let's go see what this guy wants. Yep, got that. What do you want? Kill two ships? Sure. Let's do that too. Um, got another station up there. That's where we're going next. This guy has a shield. Oh, he was a nemesis. Oh, he had a blueprint. Wait a minute, so did the shielded ones have a blueprint? I never noticed that before. I think that's how it works, though. This is big range. I don't want it. Let's go save this station. Pick up some free repairs. I don't even think we need repairs, actually. Oh, he ran. Of course he did. Scared. They're all scared of me now. Yeah, I'll take it. Sure. Of course, I'm just gonna jump in here and kill him anyway. Sorry, bud. You did have the right setup, though. He had those Vulcan cannons, which is really good for taking down drones and other sorts of ships like our bombers, but uh, he just didn't have enough firepower. And kind of sucks for him, but good for us. Oh wow, am I going to get another blueprint? He's got skull and crossbones too, as well as a shield. What's gonna happen here? Oh, he was my mission target, that's why. Okay. <laughs> he was a mission target. That's why he had skull and crossbones. Okay. Uh, let's see. Yeah. Oh, okay. I was gonna say, let's make it a big fight, but uh, let's just jump around on top of this guy. on out of this sector as fast as possible. And that's the way to do it. Drop anything? No. Okay, let's go back here. Oh, I missed a bunch of stuff. Good thing I came back. 
Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. Like the video if you liked the video. Dislike it if you didn't like it. Uh, always leave me your comments. Ask me questions. Um, leave me your life tips, whatever. You know, I'm down to talk. Um, thank you guys again for watching. Subscribe if you want more. There's a little red button somewhere on the page. You gotta find it and click it. And that's the ticket. <laughs> okay, guys, thank you. And uh, join me next time while we uh, wipe the galaxy of uh, all life except for humans.